Hey guys, welcome to Superlative Radio. Dylan Stone here with you. Hope you enjoy the following vlog. Hi guys. Today, I wanted to talk a little bit about bucket list. Did you guys ever make a bucket list? You ever just, you know, maybe one night the lights are out or something and you're sitting there and you're feeling in a bit of a pensive mood and you and all of a sudden you say to yourself, gee, what haven't I done in my life so far that I would like to do? This was a conversation that happened a couple weeks ago with somebody and actually they asked me that question. I guess they were feeling pensive, I guess. They asked me, have you ever made a bucket list? I said, no, I sort of have one up here, but you know, so they asked me, you know, well, what is it that you'd like to like, they just asked me for curiosity. What is it you'd like to do? Like, is there anything you'd like to do before you die? Kind of thing. It, it was weird because like off the top of my head, of course, I've never been to Nashville and never been to the Grand Ole Opry or been to Memphis to see uh, Graceland or anything like that. And that's always been one of my first ones since I was a teenager. And my late grandmother wanted to be the one to take me down to Nashville and Memphis and stuff because she wanted to sort of live it through my eyes. And I remember her telling me, because I wanted to, I guess I wanted to do that probably, I was first time probably around 10 or 11, I had started wanting to do that. And I was about, I don't know, 15 or 16. And she said to me, I'll get you to Nashville, you know. And I said, well, you name the time and the place and, you know, like, I'll be there, you know. She never got to, unfortunately, but it was one of the things she had wanted to do. Get me down there and just watch me go, oh, you know, that kind of thing. Anyway, that's always sort of been on my bucket list. And maybe one day, you know, now that things are opening back up a bit, at least for now, maybe at some point in my future, I can get down there and look around. Because I'd love to see the Opry, you know, the old Ryman, and I'd love to see Graceland, and I'd love to just hang out and just some of the nice southern cooking and just have fun, right? And uh, that I, I always, I don't know if I'd have the stones to do it when it certainly happened, but I'd like to, uh, somewhere in the back of my mind, I'd like to try and jump out of a plane. I'd love to parachute. Just give it a shot. It, it would be something, it's something that has always piqued my interest. I, I'd like to try it one day, but I don't know, like I said, when the time, you feel, if I got up there and was ready, I don't know if I'd have the stones to do it or not, but I'd sure like to try. Because I think it would be a, a real interesting thing. Free falling and doing that, I think it would just be something interesting to try. But we'll see. Other than that, you know, if I get to stand on the Opry stage, maybe I could get to to just play a song, even if there's nobody there, just get to play a song for the empty Opry, you know, just play for all the ghosts, the country ghosts that are there, you know. But I mean, other than that, uh, that was the only things that really, ever really piqued my mind. Because I mean, I got to meet Johnny Cash, lucky. Never got to meet Elvis, unfortunately, but you know, I did get to meet Johnny Cash. So that was one of the things that got to get checked off. But have you ever made one? You ever considered doing that? Because I'd like to know if you did, I would like to know some of the things that you'd like to do. What is it that you would like to get accomplished before your time on this rock is over? Let me know right down below. I really and truly would like to know. We will talk soon. Hey guys. Thanks for watching Superlative Radio. Come back anytime. And when you do, please make sure you subscribe. Make sure you leave a comment. We really want to know what you think. We'll see you soon. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other because that's the way it's supposed to be.